Hello everybody, welcome to Snyder's Inc. Today we got a slapped hand video. The video is these weird these weird videos will have you pointing at the TV like DiCaprio. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, comment your thing down below. Let's go. Wait, before we do. First, I had to turn my phone off to make sure we were not interrupted. Second thing I need to do, need to let y'all know if you would like to help me out with a donation, you can leave a super thanks and link to my PayPal will be in the description below. Now, let's go. How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. You're about to see some of the most mysterious videos going around the internet. So smash that subscribe button right now and get ready for some creepy content. Just like this. Just like this. From the eerie outskirts of Riverland Berry, South Australia, a peculiar piece of CCTV footage has emerged. My new plan was to mute the beginning of it, but I tried doing that in videos to stop it from being unmonetizable. It's still monetizable. It still won't monetize it. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Leaving one slapped ham viewer, Kayana S, perplexed and unnerved. Positioned adjacent to a cemetery, Kayana's home security camera inadvertently captured a scene that defies conventional explanation. Okay. Take a look. Look at it. What the fuck? Where did you come from? You, where did you come from? You just appeared. You just appeared out of thi things are popping up on my screen because I'm. Wait, she something. just got. No, where did you appear from? Someone tell me where she appeared from. She just appeared. This person just appeared out of thin air. What the fuck? Teleported there, no sh and she's ready to walk again. A figure clad in a suit and clutching a briefcase materializes into view. Wow, she just got teleported there, no sh and she's suit? ready to I walk don't again. Think that's a suit. Kayana one could be wrong. People say it's a suit. I just thought she was wearing like a jacket or something, but you know, yeah, I could be wrong. Wonders whether we're seeing a time traveller caught on camera. I can see her on this camera. Bang. I seen her. Speculation swirls as viewers dissect the mysterious occurrence. The figure's attire and abrupt appearance lends credence to the time traveller hypothesis. However, as discussions brew among the slap -tam community, theories abound. Is this a glitch in the fabric of time, or could there be a rational, albeit unconventional explanation awaiting discovery? Wow, she just got teleported there, no sh and she's ready to walk again. A Reddit user by the handle jhood3119 has stirred a wave of unease on the popular Humanoid Encounters subreddit with a chilling piece of CCTV security footage. The clip, purportedly captured in upstate New York, offers a perplexing glimpse into an eerie nocturnal encounter. According to the OP, the footage originates from a security camera installed by a friend troubled by inexplicable disturbances unsettling his dog. As the video unfolds, a figure, gaunt and peculiar, slithers stealthily across the property. All the while, the homeowner, armed with a flashlight, can be seen on the far right of the screen. Notably, the dog follows the stranger with its eyes in the bottom left-hand corner of the screen. Because hmm. after it hits this part, I can't make out the figure. But somehow everyone says it goes across screen, but I can't make out the figure. This unsettling footage raises a myriad of questions, prompting speculation and conjecture within the online community. Is this an elaborate hoax, or does it offer a genuine glimpse into the unknown? Let me know where you land on this peculiar piece of CCTV footage in the comments down below. Is the thing supposed to be that the figure disappears? Because I feel like after a certain point it vanishes off the face of the earth because I can't make it out on the camera. 
But he's not making out like disappear, like it just moves across the thing. But I can't see it from a certain point onwards. Recently, a peculiar image emerged over on our Slaptam Facebook community group, courtesy of one of our viewers, Robin J. Robin recounts a chilling experience from her visit to Salem, Massachusetts a couple of years back. While exploring the historic graveyard and surrounding areas with her sister, Robin decided to capture a snapshot of one of the town's oldest homes. Upon reviewing her photographs later, Robin made a spine-tingling discovery. In one of the images, she noticed an unexpected presence. Oh! Okay, that's weird. I actually don't know what to make of that. I... Oh, uh, yeah. I don't know. A figure peering out from a window of the ancient house. Looks like a picture to me, but okay. What makes this sighting particularly eerie is Robin's claim. Because the camera even... It makes... It looks so fucking weird on the camera. It's not even like a person looking at... Because it's not like someone's standing there looking at the camera, right? It's just some weird... Like, the way it's positioned is even weird to me. That she was all alone. So I feel like it's either... It has to be fake. No, now I think about this, is either a sticker or it's fake. That's the only option I can come up with. ...phone at the time the photo was taken, and the house was inaccessible to the public, ruling out the possibility of someone lurking just inside. Because it's not... A, it no! Describing the figure as a man clad in period attire, blue clothes adorned with an ascot and sporting dark hair and facial hair, Robin raises the eerie possibility. Could this be the spectral manifestation of a denizen from Salem's past? So what are your thoughts on Robin's eerie encounter? Do you believe she captured a ghostly visage from no. centuries past? No. Or is there a more mundane explanation? Fake. Lurking behind the window pane. Share your theories and insights, and we'll be keeping a close eye on this ghostly tale from Salem. This next one was posted to the Facebook page, Disbelief Paranormal. It's an old image that's been floating around oh, the internet for nah. some years now. Oh hell no, nah, bro. I don't want to see this. I, oh hell no, nah, bro. Nope. I don't see that in any photo I take. Nope. No one seems to know the exact origin, but it shows a woman taking a photo of herself in a mirror. Eerily, just over her left shoulder, you can see what looks like the face of another woman. Uploaded with the caption, Please tell me that's your shy daughter, the picture quickly spread around old forums. For years, viewers have been trying to debunk this eerie capture, but often fall short. So what do you think's been caught here? And have you seen this image before? Let us no. know in the comments down below. No, I haven't. It's a fucking weird looking image, I'll give them that. A recent video shared on Facebook by the page LikeV007 has stirred significant buzz within the UFO and alien enthusiast circles. Captured from what appears to be the window seat of a commercial airplane in Colombia, the footage shows something rather perplexing. While some viewers speculate that the object might be nothing more than a balloon, closer examination raises doubts about this theory. Unlike the typical form of a balloon, this object exhibits a complex design, suggesting it may be something more than a simple inflatable. I'm sorry, there's nothing complex about that design. The debate rages on in the comments section, with some leaning towards the possibility of an authentic UFO sighting, while others remain sceptical, attributing the encounter to a mundane object drifting in the sky. A bizarre video circulating within our Slaptam Facebook community page has left viewers perplexed and slightly unnerved. Okay. Take a look. 
Described by some as resembling a land jellyfish, whatever it is, it appears massive and anomalous against the backdrop of the forest. Okay, I need y'all to say this one. This clearly, right, is just a bunch of stuff stung together, right? Like trees and grass and fucking moss shit and all that. This is not a land jellyfish. Tell me, I need y'all to confirm to me this ain't a land jellyfish. And there's just a bunch of stuff somehow attached that has made it look like this. That thing's fucking huge. That is huge. Despite fervent discussion within the community, no concrete explanation has emerged. While some suggest sophisticated CGI is a plausible explanation, others have noted that it could be a rooted clump of bamboo, highlighting the other branches of bamboo just in the foreground. I'll accept that, that's what that is. That is what that is. As to why this clump would be hurtling down the waterfall remains unclear. So where do you land on this? What do you think this strange object could be? Let us know in the comments down below. Before we take a look at a photo of what many are calling conclusive evidence that Bigfoot really does exist, oh, really? remember to hit that okay. subscribe button, then tickle that little bell icon there and turn on all channel notifications. That way you'll be in the loop every time we drop our scary and intriguing videos. One of our viewers, Stacy T, brought this next one to our attention over on Facebook. There's a drawing, right? This ain't real photo. There's a drawing. Right? Like that that this, this looks like a drawing to me. Maybe I'm losing my mind. Facebook. The photograph allegedly surfaced just a couple of weeks ago over on Reddit. Many are hailing it as conclusive evidence of the existence of Bigfoot. What? However, the image's authenticity has come under scrutiny, with I'm some saying. suggesting it might be sourced from a documentary, though the exact source remains elusive. Others think it's an AI-generated image created using several composite images as its source material. Origins aside, however, some skeptics argue that it could simply be a depiction of a known primate species. However, keen observers note distinct characteristics that deviate from the norm. This ain't real. These differences have fueled speculation. To me, this is what happened if you said, draw King Kong looking at me in a picture. That's what this is. This was done by you know, and they had the, the main source was King Kong. And that this could indeed be the legendary Bigfoot. The debate rages on. Is this photographic evidence the breakthrough needed to confirm the existence of Bigfoot? Or is it merely another blip in the ongoing saga of cryptid encounters? Only time and further investigation will provide the answers. What's your take on this curious image? Ladies and gentlemen, now that is it for this reaction video because this is doing a this is a preview for Slap Tan Mysteries. And we will skip that. So ladies and gentlemen, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, comment your thing down below. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you off in a